Hey, what's up Aquamigos? How are you guys doing today? Uh, my name's Tobias and like I said in my last video, um, right now Gabby and I were actually in Ulm, Germany. This is the hotel we're staying in. It's kind of like one of those extended stay hotels. I'll give you guys a quick tour right now. This is our view out the window. And then over here, uh, this is like the bed area. We have like all our stuff right here, kind of a mess at the moment. Has a little desk, uh, some mirror right there. A uh, little kitchen area, which is pretty cool. You know, we have a fridge, stove, microwave, um, sink, the, you know, the basics. And over here, uh, closet, and then of course the bathroom is in here. A uh, nice big shower. We've been here for about 11 days now. I'm actually going home uh, in three days, the 14th, no, the 7th. The seventh, I'm going home on the seventh. But yeah, guys, I figured I might as well film a little vlog, show you guys around. Um, there's this river or little, there's streams that go like everywhere throughout the city. We're in the city of Ulm and there's this little stream over here that has like, what looks to me like wild aquarium plants, like aquarium plants in their natural habitat. So I kind of wanted to show you guys that because I thought it was pretty cool. We went to this park the other day. I'll show you guys some footage where there is like a little stream going through it and there's like fish in the stream. And there's this one fish, it was like a big eel. It had to be at least like, I wanna say three feet long. I got some footage of it, it was kind of hard to film. So now I think we're gonna go out uh, to grab something to eat and I'll show you guys around a little bit. So a couple things about uh, that we've seen in Germany so far is that there seems to be like a lot of construction going on everywhere. And if you look back here, this is the building that we're staying in. And then right ahead, there's this little river thing over there. And let's go take a look real quick. And in the water here, this is that plant I was talking about. It's like very leafy. It almost looks like it could be like some kind of java fern or something, but I don't think it is. I think it's something else. But uh, yeah, guys, if you guys can identify what that is, to me, it looks like it's like an aquarium plant. Pretty cool, they have one of those uh, water wheel things here. So today's actually Sunday and another thing about Germany or maybe a lot of Europe in general, I know Switzerland is also like this, but uh, a lot of stuff will just be closed on, on a Sunday. You know, different different work culture here. Better, in my opinion, better uh, work-life balance perhaps. We're just grabbing a quick bite to eat right now. And here's another difference, something in Germany or Europe in general that uh, is different from the US. If you order a soda or juice or something, they don't put ice in the drinks. All right, guys, so we're just about finished eating. Another thing Germany has that we don't have, at least where I live in California, is they have these giant bees <laughs> or wasps. They're literally like this big. One of them just came and landed in our salad. It was pretty freaky. And over here, guys, you can see this giant church. Apparently, it is the tallest church in the world. And we actually went to it a couple days ago. It was pretty crazy. It was pretty cool. By the way, I just thought I would throw in this clip of this beer vending machine in the lobby of our hotel. So yeah guys, we're back at the hotel again. I'll go ahead and show some clips right here of like um, other places in the city we've seen. We did quite a bit of exploring uh, during the time that we've been here. By the way, we also went to Switzerland for a few days to visit my family as well. Zurich, Switzerland and Ulm, Germany are only about three hours away from each other on the train.
before we got here, we thought it was a much smaller town than it actually is. It's actually not that small of a city. You know, in the center, you get a lot of shops, you get a lot of restaurants, a lot of nightclubs, bars, like that kind of thing. We went to a nightclub last night. I'm maybe I drank a little bit more than I should have. Today, I kind of feel like like a half shut knife kind of, I think is, I think is the saying. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff happening in the city. Um, very clean, very nice. Now, another thing that we've kind of realized since we've been here is that renting an apartment is super hard. One good thing is that rents are not so expensive here. They're quite a bit cheaper than they are in like LA. Like I would say they're less than half what the rents are in LA, but uh, they're extremely hard to get into. Like this app that she's been using, Gab Gabby's been using to find an apartment. You'll apply to an apartment and there it'll tell you how how many people are interested in renting that apartment and there there will be like 90 people in front of you who have applied for that apartment so it's extremely difficult to get into an apartment and aquamigos i almost forgot to show you this this is like our rooftop area of the place that we're staying anyone can come up here that's staying in the building and we have a crazy view over here of the the church that i was uh yeah the church that i was talking about earlier as you can see it's the biggest building in the city but anyways guys it's a really nice place i think gabby will like it she already started her new job and uh yeah guys i'll be back in la soon making pond videos so i think that'll be it for this video guys if you did like this video i'd appreciate it if you gave it a like if you'd like to see more videos by me in the future make sure that you hit that subscribe button Button and that bell notifications button if you'd like to follow me on instagram i'll put my handle right here and i'll talk to you guys in my next video peace